What's up, guys? It's Mike. Here's a common question I get uh, about Evos, what I think about Evos. Um, if you guys haven't seen my other video about why I got a Subaru or WRX, um, one of the big reasons was because the Evo lacked a certain features that I liked in a car. Now, I love Evos a lot. That's pretty much sums everything up. I like Evos. I like how they look. I like how they sound. They obviously do not have the Subaru rumble, but I like everything about them. They perform really well and they look great. I love the front of the car. So I don't hate them, period. I like all cars for the most part. One thing, or a couple things I don't like about the Evo is the interior. Um, I test drove the Evo 10, so most of my knowledge is about the Evo 10. And the interior felt very cheap and uh, plastic. So the designs lacked a lot of features, a lot of curves, and just overall the interior felt just really cheap, so I didn't really like it. When I test drove an STI, I liked the interior a lot, and also WRX, obviously the same interior. I liked the interior more on a Subaru, so I kind of went with the Subaru. And then one big thing is, as you guys already know, I use my car for hauling a lot of stuff, uh, camping, driving around um, with a lot of people and stuff. So I need a car that can hold a lot of luggage, a lot of stuff. And the Evo didn't allow you to fold down those back seats back there. So that was a really big thing for me was that Evo didn't allow you to fold down the back seats. And that's one of my biggest complaints. So besides those two, the Evo is a great car if you guys are trying to pick between getting a Subaru or getting an Evo. So basically an STI or an Evo 10, um, the Evolution 10. I would go with whatever you think looks better and what you like performance wise and then what fi fits in your life. So for me, uh, the Evo didn't fit in my life. Uh, it was really great but the seats didn't fold down so I couldn't stuff like big pieces of wood in the back. I couldn't fit all my camping gear. Uh, for a while, I fold, before I had my roof rack, I actually fold down the back seat and then stuff my bicycle in through the trunk and into the uh, back seat of the car. So I had to fold down the seats. So the Evo didn't work for me if I had that car, if I needed to put a bike in it. Uh, so to sum it up, I like the Evo a lot. It's a great car. It looks really good and I enjoy how it looks and how it drives, uh, but it just doesn't fit in my lifestyle especially with those back seats and um, yeah I, it's a great car though but that's pretty much what I think about it what do you guys think about the Evos do you guys like them or not I know there's a big rivalry between Subarus and Evos um, but there shouldn't have to be it's good that there's two of the cars or two of them because it makes the other one improve its design so that it makes people like it more so there's always a little bit of competition that's what I really like about having an Evo and a Subaru in the market you have two choices and then you have two cars to pick from uh, great car but uh, you guys let me know what you guys think if you guys like the car or not thanks guys for watching and I will talk to you guys later